Hello everybody, this is Brother Jonathan. Thank you very much for stopping by my video. And today we're talking about the Gage Instruments ECM87 cardioid microphone. This is going to be the new go-to microphone that we use for Neva the Solo Diva. This microphone was rec recommended to me by one of Neva the Soul Diva's producers, Stay High 149. Stay High 149 said that this microphone change his viewpoint on how uh, the quality of microphone you can get with a cross bang for the buck from a cross bang for the buck perspective. Stay High 149 has a Neumann U67 and he said to me that this microphone by Gage uh, Instruments, this ECM87, is right up there with his Neumann U67 microphone, which I find to be amazing. Uh, I'll make this video very quick because I'm still on sort of under, under the weather but uh, the microphone is uh, it's not heavy at all it's not light it doesn't feel like cheap junk but it's not heavy and uh, the fit and polish of it is very nice I'm very impressed with the polish of it it looks very uh, impressive uh, there is no uh, roll-off button anywhere or switch anywhere to be found on the mic and come to find out that the roll off is inside of the microphone i'm not going to open it up now and show the roll off but uh the roll off switch the high pass filter switch is inside the microphone i was not able to tell though what that frequency is set at on the high pass filter I was not able to tell that from any of the documentation, but it does say that it is located internally in, in the microphone. Uh, we did do some tests with it with Neva the Soul Diva, and she loved it a lot. It has a big, bold, smooth sound. That's what Stay High 149 kept saying about the microphone, that it's very smooth. He was so impressed with the smoothness of it. And when you look at the, um, the, the spec chart, the frequency chart you see that it is very smooth all the way uh, across the chart until it gets to maybe 10 uh, 10 K <coughs> 10 ki uh, kilohertz and then there's a bump but that 10 kilohertz does not produce uh, harshness so what I'm going to do is I'm going to uh, talk into the mic so that you can get an idea of how it sounds. I know it would be better if we had Neva singing into the mic, but just to get an idea how it sounds, I'm gonna talk into the mic. I'm gonna hook it up and talk into the mic. And let's uh, see if we can check out how it sounds. But so far, for the bang for the buck, for what this thing costs, it is very impressive. And also it comes with some software called Mic Locker Software. The Mic Locker Software is like an emulation of the greatest mics ever made the sony 800g the u67 and, and that's that's how stay high knew that this microphone was something special because when he put the mic locker so software on the u67 setting and compared it to his original authentic u67 he said it was very very close and almost indistinguishable indistinguishable so they really did a good job with the mic locker software so you get a free mic locker software plugin along with this microphone and for the price of 299 that is unbeatable so let's um hook the mic up and see how it sounds okay everybody this is brother jonathan and i'm back and uh i have the mic hooked up and you're now listening to the ecm 87. i'm approximately uh, five inches away from the microphone and I can tell you that the EC80, ECM87 is very quiet and it definitely is hotter than the other mic that I had on the um, going into the um, the preamp. It definitely has a, a denser more solid sound. It's not going through any compression or any EQ <clears throat> Excuse me, as I said, I'm under the weather. It's not going through any compression, any, any EQ. And uh, quite frankly, myself, I'm very impressed with the sound. I'm very impressed with the quietness of it. It's very quiet. 
this is not I'm not in a booth or anything I'm in my control room so what you're listening to is going to have some noise because the control room is not 100% uh, quiet but I'm very impressed with the sound of the microphone the microphone also comes with um, a pop filter and a uh, shock mount the shock mount is one of those inexpensive shock mounts but it's more than enough to get you going and the pop filter is a metallic pop filter which um, I don't have one I've never used one of those before but uh, let's see if I can get a shot of the pop filter in the video hold on <coughs> you see it just comes with it in the box uh, it's made of metal so I've never used one of those before but I'm, I'm definitely looking forward to trying it out so this is the ECM 87 by gauge microphones or gauge instruments and I think that for the most part that for the price it cannot be beat for the money for the price for the quality that you get it's definitely something that you want to look into and going on state high 149's recommendation I if he's saying that this this microphone is something that you're gonna want to have it's gonna be your go-to mic he, 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 he said to me forget about all your other mics once you start to use this mic he said forget about all of your other mics again I'm about five inches away from the microphone as we're speaking and you and here you hear that denseness so and it, it's not overly bright again you have that bump at about 10 to 15 K but it's not it's not overly bright and it has that solidness in the low end so that's that's really nice I like it I like it a lot this is brother Jonathan and uh, leave your comments and um, please subscribe if you can and thank you very much again for stopping by checking out my checking out my video and I hope to have more videos for you soon thank you